something like that. So we're going to talk about a very special event coming up this Thursday. But here, let's take a look at this. Hey Cyclone Nation, this is Coach Campbell. Come join us in Des Moines, Iowa, August 23rd for our new Cyclone Unplugged event to start off the fall football season. The event is at Cole's Commons from 5.30 to 8 p.m. with live music from Standing Hampton, food trucks, beverages, and more. Myself and other Iowa State coaches are excited to meet and greet with the best fan base in the country. The best part about the event is attendance is free. See you in Des Moines on August 23rd. Go Cyclones! Well, there you go. Unplugged. That is going to be pretty cool, Jackie. Well, we're going to find more details about it right now. Very excited to have Lindsay Long and John Walters joining us in studio because you guys are thinking back to school as well up in the Ames area What this Thursday, right? Well, so college starts today. So today, as far as all of our kids, yeah. <laughs> going back to school. <laughs> but all the kids go back this day. on Thursday. So everybody's in that state of mind and yeah. ramping up uh, once again for their school spirit. And the mm -hmm. Cyclones are saying, we're coming to Des Moines and showing our pride this Thursday. We are. We're excited to bring this new event to Des Moines. And we uh, are excited, especially to be able to bring the coaches down and say, interact the, with the fans. The video showed the coaches, and mm -hmm. they were excited about coming down. So they are, they're going to be here then? They are, okay. yes. So Matt Campbell, Bill Finley, Steve Prohm, Christy Johnson Lynch, uh, Kevin Dresser, and all of our other coaches, too, to come down and um, interact with our fans. Well, oh, I, okay, fun. now the coaches are here. I'm just wondering if the voice of the Cyclones is going to show <laughs> up, too, because that's what we really need to find out. So, John Walters, uh, are you going to be able to attend? If I can follow the directions, I'll, I'll be there. <laughs> uh, I, yeah, no, we're excited. It's, uh, it's cool because we've had a, a lot of events through years. An event called Meet the Coaches Night has always been kind of our kickoff to the season right before, and that's been in Des Moines. But it's always been a little bit more formal. Not super formal, but a sit-down dinner and then a, a program. This is more interactive, and we want our fans to be able to get out and actually talk to the coaches more and uh, literally meet the coaches and get a picture and get an autograph, so it's going to be fun. I was going to say, so what, what does this look like? Because we know Cole's Commons is a great place to go and, yeah. and you know grab a food, grab a beverage, but what does the day actually look like on this Thursday? Yep, so the doors will open at 5 and we'll have the band start playing at 5.30. We'll have food trucks from Hotsi Totsi, Roadside Tacos, uh, oh, the Outside Scoop, and oh, good stuff Top Bun yeah. are our four um, trucks. And then we'll have uh, beverages from Anheuser-Busch products and um, meet and greet until about 6.45. And then 6.45, we'll start a short program. And John will interview some of the coaches. And we'll end with Matt Campbell. That Very works. nice. So what are some of the tough questions we're going to be asking going into a new season? <laughs> well, uh, yeah, what kind of season Iowa do you State? expect? Yeah. Uh, are all the guys healthy? Uh, <laughs> uh, we'll are keep, you ready to go? There'll be some softballs. But, um, no, you know, it's funny because when we kind of came up with this concept, and I think Lindsay had more to do with this than anybody, but she and Jamie Pollard are always trying to keep things fresh and mm -hmm. new and different. And um, Jamie's done many great things at Iowa State. He's done tremendous facility improvements. He's done great coaching hires, uh, created a really positive culture there at Iowa State. But I think right at the top of the list of the things he's done was to create the Cyclone Tailgate Tour, which is in the summer. Mm -hmm. And we go around to various communities, load all our coaches into a bus, and we stop in 12 cities across the state of Iowa over a six-day period. And it is really that opportunity for fans. If you want that autograph with Matt Campbell, you're going to get that chance. If you want to meet Steve Prohm and ask him a question, you're going to get that chance. And so it's a lot of one-on-one, -on -one, and it's informal. It's not a big sit-down dinner, but you can get food. And that's just been so successful. And young kids coming out and really enjoying it, games for the kids. And so uh, this is much more of a family-type environment. And it's so successful out across the state, we thought, let's bring it to Des Moines, and I think it's got a chance to really be successful here. I like that idea because a lot of times you don't always think, you know, well, they're close enough, they can come and see us and say hi, but you don't always have that opportunity to meet the coach or say yeah. hello or get pumped up for the new season. I think what we found with the Meet the Coaches Night, even though it was a great event, was that people would come and they'd sit down at their tables and then the coaches would come in and they'd go up to the stage and they'd do their talk and everybody would get to hear them, but you want to interact with you them. You want to meet yeah. them. Yeah. yeah. You want to get exactly. your selfie. Yeah, you exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So this should give that more opportunities because we'll keep the program very short so people will have a chance to visit with the coaches before the program starts. Coach Campbell will have to get out of there right after the program because of practice, but the rest of them will... Practice? Uh, practice. Talking about practice. <laughs> yeah. And the rest of them will stick around and... Uh, 
and, and we'll have more opportunities for those those pictures. Wonderful, and, and it kind of makes you feel like you're part of the program if you're able to, you know, actually go up, shake their hand, talk to them a yeah. little bit. Yeah, and you know, Jamie always called it planting seeds, uh, getting those young kids out across the state. Um, th there have been kids that have come up to us at the Cyclone uh, tailgate tour outings that said, hey, I, I came to this when I was a little kid and really? now I'm a student at Iowa State. And mm -hmm. so planting the seeds, watching Early. them grow, it all turned out great. Wonderful. All right. So we need the details once again so we can get as many sure. people there as possible. It's free. It's it free. Is free. It's free. That's Love the best part. that. That's the best part. You have an opportunity of buying your own food and drink. Right. And then uh, doors open at 5. We'll have some giveaways. And then uh, 5.30 the band will start playing and 6.45 we'll have uh, the interviews with the coaches. Well, you got a great band that's going to be playing too. Standing, Standing Hampton. Hampton, one of the favorites around here too. One of Ames' favorite bands too. So maybe we'll get some people from even there Absolutely. coming up here. Absolutely. Uh, but it'll be a, a lot of fun. And the coaches are very approachable. That's the one thing that yes. we want to make sure that's I want to stress here for this event. So they love it. a first kind first time event. This should be a success. We think so. We think a lot of people will come out and it'll be a lot of fun. Hopefully we get good weather. Perfect. Yeah, that works. All right. All right. Thank you both for joining us this us. morning. Thank, Thank you so us. much. It is seven